I had an old mill and I hated using it because it just flour was everywhere and you'd have to clean it up and it was so noisy. So when I would make homemade bread, whole wheat bread, I would plug it in with an extension cord in the backyard and I hated using it. And it was just, and so I really honestly wouldn't make whole wheat bread very often because it was too much of a bother. So then when the Wonder Mill came out and I started using that, it went from making bread, you know, like every five or six times to every time because it was so easy to use. I could just pull it out, hook it up, grind my flour and have wonderful flour. My, I think my real love for the Wonder Mill came when I was diagnosed that I couldn't eat wheat anymore. But I loved cookies and brownies and all that kind of stuff. And so I had this mill and I got all the grains and I started grinding and I had the most wonderful time creating recipes that I didn't have to use wheat and I didn't feel like I missed anything because I could make these wonderful chocolate chip cookies that were wheat free that tasted exactly like, not exactly like, I'd have to say better because they had a nice nutty quality to them. The Wonder Mill allowed me that opportunity to really expand my knowledge of grains. Because I'm a brain man, people send me their mills to try, and I, and not that they're bad mills, but the Wonder Mill, I always go back to it because it, it really is faster and quicker, easier to clean, and, and I could run for hours on that thing and it just keeps grinding and grinding. And to have the same mill for 15, 20 years, that says something about the product. It's just an amazing mill.